Hey, I'm messing around with GMT's Vietnam, 1965 to 1975. I'm just kind of practicing here with some random units. And what we're going to be doing here later on is a sample uh, search and destroy phase, uh, search and destroy operation during a game turn. And what I plan on doing, I just kind of mark some stuff down here, is neither one is going, well, the allied player is going to get four air points. And then no one's going to be doing strategic movement or hold or patrol operations. We're going to go to the designation segment where the allied player here, the third Marine battalion is going to declare search and destroy. And then the support segment is where you mark on your turn record track that the U.S. has four air, point, air points, I believe. It would go up. I'm sorry. It would go on here. And I literally just punched out a few of these to test the rules for this game. And then at that point, I'm not using my tripod either. At that point, you would do a movement segment and there would be an alert segment uh, here. We don't know. I know what's in here because I kind of picked it out. But, you know, I'm just kind of pretending that we don't know what, what's, what VC are in there. That's my target hex. There could be alert movement where they would move out. And then I declare interdiction and interdiction works with your air power and that is on page i had to get these thoughts down in the video real quick um that's all the way back at 7.2.5 so let me just get to the it's on page 21 of the rules of play and for every three air if three support points are applied to interdict a hex plus one movement point is added to get out of it so what i'm trying to do is to keep them if they want to run and, and disperse and get out with alert movement, I'm trying to slow them down so that uh, I have a chance to eliminate them. Uh, if you do seven or more, uh, the movement point cost is plus two to get out. So I just made a little marker with one some of the blank uh, counters they give you here just to kind of remind myself of how all that is going to work. And then after you declare interdiction, you go back and you kind of follow this flow chart here for search and destroy, it tells you to go to diagram A, and then you're gonna lift this bad boy out and kind of go here. And you're gonna kind of follow along, designate operating units. Is this an allied search and destroy op? Yes, you can roll for rangers. Then you declare your interdiction. Are there VC defenders? Yes, there's an alert roll that the VC units can take and they could disperse. So I'm gonna to try to follow this along and see if I can learn this game and then worry about the record keeping later. But anyway, that's my little uh, Vietnam jaunt tonight.